everybody! My name is DecemberQueen16, and this is going to be the start of my how-to Minecraft tutorials. My tutorials are going to be basically for building and decorating, interior design, stuff like that. I'm not the greatest in the world, but I thought, you know, hey, you know, I could share my tips, and then you could combine it with somebody else and make something even better. So anyway, today's episode is going to be on fireplaces which I've made several on this super flat world show you guys a few ideas of how to do fireplaces and this one right here I built with stone brick and cracked brick and some stone brick slabs that I just broke <laughs> well then let me fix that real quick it's gonna bother me if I don't anyway to keep the fire continuously going, I use nether rack, which I'll go ahead and destroy these and show you. I didn't know <laughs> before the nether rack stayed lit until you put it out. So, like, my first fireplaces had lava in them, which was a disaster. I lit my house on fire. Um, but thank goodness somebody told me about this, and now I use nether rack. <laughs> but anyway, this is the first one. It's simple and little. I just love crack brick, it's my favorite. This one right here has chiseled sandstone and sandstone slabs. It's kind of nice for a desert home, maybe, or if you have lighter colors in your room. This next one over here, I use nether brick and sandstone slabs, which really you could mix up any materials that you want. I just put some together that I thought looked good. I thought that the tan look good with the purple for that one. Then this next one, I used the chiseled stone brick with stone brick slabs. To me, this one reminds me of like a kitchen with tile on the wall. Maybe you could put it in there. Pretend it's um, like a fire you cook over. I'm not sure. Whatever you want to do. Works for me. <laughs> this next one is brick and I have quartz slabs and I put the flower pots on top to kind of show what a mantle maybe you could put a painting up there or uh, item frames doesn't really matter whatever you want to do and then this one is stone brick slabs just the whole thing very simple but elegant and then this last one is my favorite. This one is quartz, pill pillared quartz, quartz slabs, and quartz blocks. I put the chillered quartz right there behind those. Let me fix that for you. Whoops. <laughs> Wrong button. And then I put uh, pillared quartz, which I really love. And the trick with the pillared quartz is, like when you're building with logs from trees, you just gotta face down to make it go upright. Or if you face sideways, it goes like that. So when you're doing pillars with the decor, I, I usually just hop or fly. <laughs> Whatever <laughs> mode you're on, survival, creative. And this one, I, I made the base wider on it. It makes it look more elegant. Um, this would look really great in a modern house or a, or the houses from like the plantations in s Southern America. And I mean the USA, not South America. <laughs> but yeah, so anyway, this is my video on fireplaces. Hopefully it's not lame and hopefully you learned something. And uh, I'll be doing random industrial design. Oh, I said industrial. Interior design. <laughs> oh, I fail. But yeah, random tutorials for you guys. And I hope you like them. And please subscribe. And I'll try to post them as often as I can. Thanks for watching.